What if I told you that you can make a video just by typing a prompt or by providing a photo? Well, it's possible, and here's how you can do it using the free Discord bot without getting beaten by your parents. Alright, to get started, just go to this website called pika.art, once you're there, click on join beta, this will take you to their server invitation on Discord, if you're already using Discord, just join the server, if you're not, create an account first and then join. Once you are done now open your Discord, you can use their app or web version. Once you're there, you'll come across something like this, now, head over to the Pika server where you'll find a welcoming getting started channel, to kick off your creative process, navigate to the create category, there, you'll notice individuals crafting videos. You can begin utilizing your bot at this point, however, since many people might be using it simultaneously, it could get confusing, I suggest you have a one-on-one -on -one conversation with the bot for clarity, to do this, right-click on the bot's profile and select send message, this way, only you and the bot will be in the conversation. Currently, this bot provides two types of generation, text-to-video and image-to-video, for text-to-video, initiate the process by typing the slash command and choosing create, afterward, just type the prompt you want to use for your creation, by the way, I'm not very knowledgeable about AI, so I'll provide a simple prompt. After that it will start generating your video so wait until it is fully finished. Once that's done you can view the video. The outcomes are quite impressive, however, if you don't like the current video you can always create a new or create a variation of this specific video from these buttons. Alright, so it was about the text to video which is very simple, now let's explore the image to video. To utilize the image to video feature, initiate the process by entering the slash command, then, click on more, or simply tap the right key, you'll come across an option labeled image, select that and proceed to upload the photo you wish to convert. This could be a personal picture, something generated by AI, or any other image you prefer. After that step, input your desired instructions for the picture, by the way, I've incorporated certain parameters in the prompt that play a crucial role in crafting the video, therefore, ensure you watch the video until the end, or I'll provide an explanation. Once you are done, simply hit enter and wait for the bot to generate a video from the image. Alright, you can see that the video has been perfectly generated based on what I communicated to the AI, by the way, there's an issue, the video is only 3 seconds long, however, there's no need to worry because I'll also share a trick to extend its length at the end. Right now, let's discuss the parameters guide, it's fairly simple. There are currently two parameters, and it means that how much motion you want the AI to apply to your video. The first one is for your character or object motion, you're telling AI that how much motion or movement you need to put to my video character or object. The values are from 1 to 15. The more value you put the more your character or object will move like moving his hairs, hands, lips etc. And the motion parameter is about your background movements and motion. Let's take a look at these examples. In the first video, I used the character parameter, so my video character is moving a lot while the background remains still. In the second video, I used the motion parameter, so my character stays still while the background trains are moving. Now let's talk about video length trick. It's quite simple, you will need to do is take a screenshot at the end of your video, then use the same process to generate the videos, make sure to take an HD screenshot for better results. Alright, so it was a simple video about the Pika video generator, and I hope this AI will help you a lot. So this is the end of the video, thanks for watching and peace out.